muscle memory through myonuclear addition. You would have seen that it takes a very long time to build muscle. But if you were to take a break, you can bounce right back into the game. Why does this happen? So there are many, many things at play. But one of the phenomena which are obviously happening is called as myonuclear addition. So when you have a muscle, an untrained muscle, the fiber is much thinner with a few nuclei to it. But as you keep exercising, the muscle fibers get bigger in size, which we call as hypertrophy. But there are also these satellite cells which lend their nuclei to this muscle fiber, which is working much harder. So now you have a muscle fiber which is much bigger in size because it is hyper, hypertrophied. Not only that, you have many more nuclei attached to it. Let us suppose you take a break now after the hypertrophy. The muscle obviously shrinks in size which we call as atrophy. But the advantage now is you have many more nuclei attached to it though the muscle has shrunk. So the advantage here is whenever you start exercising again, these nuclei bring about the magic to hypertrophy much quicker and faster. That is the advantage to you. And this is called as myonuclear addition. So if you were to stop exercising for the next two weeks, nothing is going to happen. There's not going to be much of atrophy, nothing. But if you were to stop exercising well beyond three weeks or so, then myonuclear addition is, come, is going to help you get right back into the game. So this is what we call as the muscle memory. So muscle mem memory can mean different things in different contexts. So with respect to uh, neuromuscular system, it can mean different things. But when, it, when you're talking about the muscle in itself, this is what we call as muscle memory because it helps you get right back into the game.